have no idea what she's like, Jason. My own mother locked me in a cellar without even a hairbrush or a change of clothes. There are disgusting things there that crawl around There are crazier people than your here, mother. But not more desperate. My mother wants Andrew's money so badly, she will do anything to get it. She's an amazing liar. Okay, that's right. Sam is the smartest woman in the world, and you know I'm everything. I'm not going to stand here and argue with do you. Do you listen to anyone? My mother has a gift for spotting weakness. She will find Sam's, zero in on it, take what she wants, and use it against her. Go ahead. Stick the blade through my heart. Or slit my throat, whichever seems least distasteful. Before you do, will you promise me one thing? Promise me you'll protect my darling Alicia. That is your plan, isn't it? To kill me and escape with the man you love? If you do, what we tell you, there will not be a problem. How do I get to the harbor? How am I supposed to know where my mother... You know where she hit the boat. Just tell me. You are nuts if you think Sam is going to pull one over on my mother. Uh, okay, okay, I get it. Just quit whining. How's Sam's relationship with her mother? Sam's mother's dead. That's my mother's specialty. She knows how to play act at motherhood a whole lot better than the real thing. How far will your mother go to get her way? You want to know if she'll kill Sam? When someone ticks my mother off, she doesn't just stop asking them to dinner. They pretty much disappear. I'm so ashamed it's come to this. I was raised with nothing but the best in life. I was so fortunate when others had so little. And there was one thing my mother always drummed into my head. Protect the family. Protect our name at all costs. Though I doubt she ever imagined I'd be kidnapping innocent lovers and threatening them. But Sam, what else could I do? My father always figured the next grift would be the one to save him. You want it so bad, it twists you all up inside. My poor Alicia. And all she ever wanted was a, a sweet man to love her. Because God knows she never got any love from me. But my obsession with money stole that happiness from her. You know, you know it's not too late. If I could just find some way out of all this mess. I'm already so deeply in it. The wedding preparations are made. Well, there's only one way out for me that I can see. You can go ahead. No, do what please. you came here to do. Take away my pain and leave here with Jason. Get out while you can. You have a cell phone? My mother took it. All the estate phones are hidden. There is one in the banister in the parlor. Could be Sam. No, no, no. Or your mom. Hide. How are you, Jason? Where's Sam? You'll see her soon. We had a lovely talk. She's such a sweet girl. So sensitive. If she's hurt in any way... Now, why I'll... would I do that? Actually, Sam's opened my eyes. She made me see what a mess I've made of things. But I promised her, and I promise you now, you will not come to harm. No, I, I want proof that Sam's alive. I could never kill Sam. Nor she me, as it turns out. We understand each other from the heart. But you're afraid for Sam, and I can understand that. Ever since her mother died, she's been yearning for a woman that she could feel a close connection to. And I feel as if I've found the daughter I was always meant to have. Sam could spot your con a mile away. <laughs> what con? The maternal angle. It's your specialty. Your own daughter filled me in. You know, the one you locked in the cellar? I want to see Sam. Right now. Sam is unhurt. Prove it. Well, I'd love to, but if you kill me, I can't quite do that, can I? Let her go. Just drop the gun. Dante will shoot you if you kill me. He'll have no reason not to. 
The only chance you have of seeing Sam again is to let me go now. Jason is a reasonable man. He just lost his way momentarily out of love for Sam. I'd say his rougher edges are more suited to my own ungrateful daughter, but then that's another story. She should let me see Sam. Dante, take Mr. Morgan to see Sam. Give them a moment or two to rekindle, and then bring him back down here. Sam has chosen to cooperate. I believe you will, too. Listen for Dante. Good evening. May I help you? Yes, yes. I, I need to dial the number in New York. Of course, sir. Your access word? What, access word? Uh, money. I'll need the correct access word to make your call, sir. Allegra's got this place locked down. What, what happened? What happened to the plan? I think it's going to be a whole lot easier just to do what she wants. What do you mean, do what she wants? She was in tears. Okay, she totally gets how nuts this plan of hers is. She's looking for a way out. I do not think that our lives are in danger here. And if she wasn't in such a panic, she would have freed us on the spot. We just need a little bit do more you, time right now. Do you right believe now. her? Yeah. Do you trust her? No. No, Jason, but she is in a lot of pain, okay? And she realizes what she's done to her daughter, and it, I mean, she kind of reminds me of my own mother, but Allegra is a lot of things, and she's got a lot of problems, but a killer is not one of them. She is not a killer. All you had to do was wait quietly in your little room. You chose to make trouble, as usual. Well, you know how easily bored I am, Mother. Yes, when you're not wasting money or sleeping around. I learned from the best. Whatever little scheme you and Jason cooked up, it's beside the point now. Did you do something to him? Don't be ridiculous. Jason is far too valuable to get rid of now. It's no wonder Sam loves him. Have you twisted her arm yet? Sam is a dear, sweet girl. A charming surprise, actually. Now, it would seem that there's only one person on this island who no longer serves a purpose. And that's you. <laughs> <laughs> 